Good morning guys, it is currently 9 a.m. Just now having my my breakfast right here and my coffee. Gonna go hang out with the family. I have practice at 10.15 this morning and my match is at not before 4.30 this afternoon because I got a buy in the first round. So just having a nice easy morning. So yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along with me through this weekend and we'll see how it goes. All right, so we're currently, it's 9.47 a.m. Oh, we're late. Yes, we are a little bit late. <laughs> we're currently on our way to practice, to warm up, because if you guys saw from my last video, I just came back this Monday from Argentina playing 225Ks. It's currently Saturday of that same week, and I'm playing a money tournament in Boca Raton. The reason why, because in those 225Ks in Argentina, although I made a good result in the second week, semis of singles and doubles, I actually came back negative with the prize money. So my expenses were just way more than my prize money. The $25,000 futures tournament that I played in Argentina, the winner doesn't get $25,000 in prize money. What a $25,000 tournament means is that it's a pot of $25,000 that gets distributed between each round. So the champion makes 3,500 US dollars. So me making it to semis, I would have made $1,100, but since I played in Argentina, they paid me in pesos, which the conversion from pesos to US dollars is way less. And on top of that, they took out 21% of taxes, I think. So I came back with very little money. So instead of teaching lessons, which is what I used to do to make money, I felt that teaching lessons was hindering my training sessions because I was just too tired. I'm just deciding to play money tournaments on the weekend so that at least it gives me the opportunity to practice in a match situation as well as you know make a decent amount of money if I win the whole tournament so that's what we're doing this weekend and that's where I'm taking you on so we're on our way to practice now Freezing cold out here. Just just like Argentina. <laughs> just like Argentina. 30 degrees, except Celsius. Not, not Fahrenheit. I miss your face. Is it pretty? It's sweaty. <laughs> okay, so I just did my... Uh, I did a 30 minute warm up. Like, mas o menos. I don't know how to say that in English. More or less. M more or less, thank you. Wow. Wow, Argentina's got me all in Spanglish. Yeah, I did 30 minutes uh, warm up because I was feeling good and with this heat I really don't want to do too much. We're on our way back home now to rest, have some lunch, and then we're going to leave the house probably around 2, 2.30ish because it's an hour drive. So the good thing about this tournament is that it gives you money if you win the whole thing and it's only an hour away from my house so I can stay at my house, I can drive back and forth and it doesn't bother me. The bad thing about this tournament is that I don't want to play it, so... <laughs> but these are the things you got to do to grind and make it on the Pro Tour. So it's not all lavish. So just remember that. Alright guys, we're on our way. We have an hour drive, so I'll see you guys when we get there. Alright guys, we just got here. It's 4 o'clock, so I play in 30 minutes and it looks like they're on time, so... I'm gonna start doing my physical warm-up, but... I was just telling Luisa, who's filming this wonderful video, thank God, that these tournaments make me extremely nervous because it's unlike pro tournaments. Here, if you lose, you're out and you don't make any money. At least in pro tournaments, when you lose, you get some points towards your ranking and you make some money with it. So I just feel a little bit of added pressure here, but I'm just going to go out and, and do my best. Hello. Hi, Katarina. Hi, Luisa. How are you? <laughs> Good, thank you. How was your match? My match? Um, you know, 
I think that I was just the better player at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. I mean, How were your nerves? Oh, I, once I got on the court and I started doing the five minute warm up, I felt a lot better. Uh, I still felt like a little bit of throw up right here. But can you just tell the the people in the world that I told you so? Can you just say that? I know, but it's 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 like you know you never know what's gonna happen. So like that uncertainty like gives me that those nerves. It's not so much the winning and losing. It's just uncertain of how I'm gonna play. I understand that. But I'm happy like with my win and tomorrow I got two matches so I really gotta hydrate, fuel up and, and rest today. Mm, I love that. So, it was pretty hot, huh? Yeah, it's super hot. I went O and O and look at my yeah, face. I was melting. Yeah. Just want you to know. Yeah, and you were in the shade. I was. Okay. Lucky you. Bye. Bye. Good morning, Papi. Good morning. Chef Luisa! Yeah. Getting that breakfast ready. I play yeah. at 10.45 this morning, so... You know what time we woke up? <laughs> 6 o'clock. Yeah, we woke up at 6 because we got to get these little rascals ready. They're eating their breakfast right now. We have warm up at... Um, we. 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 This is a team effort. I have warm up at 9.30. So, getting ready for that right now. Hi, Kat. Hi. How was your warm up? Good. I got a good warm up with uh, Blast from the Past. Christina, we used to play together when we were 12 years old, Super National Finals and, and Super National Doubles Finals. So uh, that was fun. All right. And how's the weather? <laughs> Super humid, <laughs> even more humid than yesterday. So uh, it's going to be really tough today, and I have to stay hydrated. And thankfully, I brought my white outfit because I need all the, uh, all the uh, coolness that I can get. <laughs> And how's your mind today? Mind? Good. Uh, my nerves are gone. So I think anytime I play a tournament, no matter what level it is, the first round, I always have those nerves. But once I get the reps in, I feel like now it's just having fun out there and doing my best. Perfect. Good luck today. Thanks. Hi, Kat. Hi. How was your match? It was good. I thought I played well, but the conditions, it's really, really humid and hot compared to yesterday, so I wasn't feeling too great, but, and my opponent was better than, than the one yesterday. She kept more balls in play, so I was really feeling the effect of the weather, but we had a little bit of cloud coverage, so it helped me out a little bit, and I pulled it through in the end. Okay, how are you feeling? A little tired. The conditions are different, you know? So I just came from opposite conditions, so I think it's going to take me a little bit to to get used to, but now I have another match this afternoon, so I have to get ready for that one. What are you gonna do to prepare for that match? I'm gonna take a shower now, a nice cold shower, go eat something, hydrate with salt and electrolytes, and just chill in the shade and air conditioning <laughs> until I have to come back out here. Okay, well, good luck. Thanks. We just finished eating lunch and we came back to the site and to our surprise it is raining hard. Actually, oh. well not anymore. It's not raining hard anymore, but it rained hard and there were matches scheduled at 1:30 that obviously are not on the court anymore, so it's going to be delayed I think quite a bit. So we're just going to wait around here in the car. I'm going to edit some videos and pictures and to see, I'm supposed to be scheduled to play at 3 o'clock and it's currently 1.50. At we least it's not hot! Yeah, for now. This is kind of, you know, the grind because we can't really drive home because it's an hour away. So we're just gonna have to wait it out. Yay, go us! <laughs> okay, we'll come back with an update when we know. Turns out that my match was not delayed because shortly after the sun and wind came out. So it is currently 2.50, so I'm gonna warm up now. And play my match it's even more humid than this morning and i ran out of white cool outfits so i will be burning in black but let's just go out there and do our thing hey guys i literally 
shook my opponent's hand and ran out of there because the rain was inching closer and closer and when I was up a set in 2-1 I saw and heard the thunder and the lightning getting closer so I was like okay I need to speed this up but all in all I didn't play my best tennis and it was a little bit difficult with the wind swirling because of the rain coming in but we're moving on now to the semifinals against another professional actually who's ranked in the 300 so tomorrow is going to be another tough match and if I get past that one then we have the finals in the afternoon so two more matches tomorrow so heading home now and resting and recovering for tomorrow so see you guys tomorrow a few moments later I know, I know it looks weird that I'm wearing sunglasses in the rain, but promise that I can see better. Okay, it slowed down now. Oh, um, thank God. We can kind of see I that. could not see for like 10 minutes. Good morning, guys. It is currently 6.50. I am on my way to practice to warm up. I have my match this morning at 9.30. I'm all alone today, so it's just going to be me vlogging everything. Unfortunately, because it is Monday, Luisa has to work, everyone has to work, so I can't have anyone following me around with the camera. Just another struggle that comes along with this grind that we call tennis, but I'm going to do my best to take you along with me. I'm going to do my best to grab some points, some highlights, and continue on with the interviews. But let's get ready, let's go warm up, and get ready for my match. Alright guys, I just finished my warm-up. I'm in the car now at the club here that I train at in Kendall. It's an hour and 15 minute drive to the tournament site, but I have my food here in the car that I have to eat first. And I was just thinking on the way back to my car before I was going to record to say how much easier it is when someone is traveling with you. I know that Luisa was mainly going with me to the tournament to vlog and get this content for you guys. But it's just such a big help to have someone, you know, help you prepare your food, help you pre prepare your bags, make sure that you have everything. So now today that she's not here and I have to do everything by myself, I'm like, ah, you know. So eventually when I'm on the pro tour, I would love to get to that point where I can financially, you know, provide for the both of us so that she can come along with me and just make my life easier, obviously. And so she can enjoy the traveling and and the pro tour life that everyone thinks is so lavish. These are the things that we have to do in order to make it to that end goal of traveling with your partner and you know living that nice life of you know not worrying about finances. So yeah, that's my little uh, rant of the morning, but I'm gonna eat this now and then I got that hour and 15 minute drive and I'll see you guys when I get over there. All right guys, I just made it to the site. The weather today is actually not so humid, so I'm super happy about that because yesterday was torture. But feeling good, I felt really good in the warm up. I feel good about this weather and I have high hopes for this match. I'm excited about it. I love the fact that at a ran such a random tournament that I'm playing another professional. It's great practice for me and given that it's in weird kind of circumstances and weird scoring, so there's no ads here. So when it gets to deuce, the next point wins. And also the third set, if you happen to reach that point, is a 10 point tie break. So it's just really pressured, I feel like, and just, you know, cut short the, the scoring system, which I like. This is really good for me to play this match, to practice this way. And I'm just gonna go out there, do my best, have some fun, and we'll see how it goes. So talk to you guys after the match. Guys, I freaking won my match. Let's go! I played so well today. It was such a hard match. We had so many deuce points that were deciders of the game, which I had a feeling it was gonna be like that. I was up 3-1 and then I lost the next three games by deuce points and then we were 4-3, 4-4, 5-4, 5-5, 6-5, 6-6. And then in the tie break in the first set, I won 7-0. I told myself, Cat, lock it in, bro, and don't miss one ball. And I literally didn't miss one ball. Then in the second set, we were grinding again. 1-1, one, 2-2, one, two, two, three, 3 And then from 3-3 three, three on, I raised my level a little bit, and I think she 
kind of lost focus and dropped her level, her energy level, and I closed it out 6-3. So moving on to the finals. That match was two hours long, so it's currently 11.40. I have my finals match at 1.30, so I'm gonna change real quick, hydrate, go eat, and come back for my finals. But let's freaking go, man, let's freaking go. Okay guys, it is officially 20 minutes before my finals match. It is hot and steamy now. I definitely feel the humidity and the heat has risen. I actually have my shoes out and my ankle braces out drying until the last minute because I was squishing and squashing from my first round match. But I'm feeling good. I'm really proud of how I've done so far and I'm looking to take home the win now. So I'm gonna do my best, have some fun with it, and hopefully we come out with a W. But I will update you guys on the result afterwards. So wish me luck and here we go. Well guys, I didn't get the W, but I did get my check. With making it to the finals, I got a check of $500. The entry fee was $125, so that's a $375 profit. Not much, but at least it's something, right? I hope you guys enjoyed this video to see how much of a grind it really is for $375 for these last three days, two matches a day grinding in this heat right after coming back from two professional tournaments that I didn't make any profit in. So now we're gonna take this, put it back towards my tennis and continue on. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below and turn your bell notifications on for my next post. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.